Well, many can cancer patients experience extreme exhaustion from their treatment, and this fatigue is especially difficult for women responsible for running a home. But as Lori Johnson shows us, many of them are getting help with the housework for free. Despite her ovarian cancer, Stacy Schwinghammer resolved to be strong for her children. Whatever energy I had, I needed to use to keep their lives normal and consistent with, with uh, routines that they were normally used to. And then of course when they went to school, back in bed I went and just didn't move until it was time when they got home. Cancer treatment, especially chemotherapy, drains your energy, sometimes for weeks on end. Many women don't even have the strength to clean their homes. Now they're getting help, free maid service once a month for four months, an idea that grew from one Dallas cleaning business. So I did it as a company policy for many, many years. And then fast forward years later, I turned that company policy into a nonprofit, and now we have maid services all over the country that are donating free house cleaning to women with cancer. Over a thousand cleaning services from all 50 states are on board. You know, a lot of times patients don't want to have family clean their home. They don't want to have their best friend come clean their home. And having a stranger sometimes do that is a little bit easier. So far, 15,000 women have received this gift. My whole world changed just knowing I could count on them. Cancer patients or cleaning services that would like to get involved can find a link to the Cleaning for a Reason website at CBNNews.com. Lori Johnson, CBN News.